Previously on Xenoblade, corn goes free. In that case, yes? Did you think of something? <laughs> Food. Right now, I think I'd like one of your onigiri. <laughs> Quiet. Always on the same mind track too. I was thinking about getting some food right now. <laughs> and now back to. Have you never prayed that time would simply stop? First, let's talk about all the stuff you might want to do in the future. Affirmative. Which is Lily? Hmm. Not a recognizable voice actor from anything I've seen on her on her IMDB page. <laughs> she just sounded very familiar for talk as another character, I guess. Huh. Apparently Stanley Townsend was the narrator for both Evil Chronicles 2 and Torn of the Golden Country. Along with Victor Hugo, Vladimir Trunkov, and Ivan the Luktotrak in Cars 2. Star Life. Thought it was familiar to one thing, to one name, I just wasn't aware it would be that. <laughs> now, if you excuse me, I'm gonna go grab some food and we can go grab any and all. Battles on the field that are mostly for silver coins. So we can get a couple of his class up to level 10 and get back our first party member of him. So uh, I'll be right back. Even more unique monsters I need to fight. God dang. <laughs> well, now I so, so much time running down for the soul hacker class, but yet, not doing it on to even take care of them. But maybe it's because right now we're currently focused on getting this up and not whole classes. <laughs> I also expect us to go inside the Hawaiian Titan, but. And then that be a smooth region, but uh, I'm perfectly fine with this now, looking back on it. I found something shiny. I mean, honestly, it would have made too much sense just having the Cloud Keep at DIY and Titan. You know, considering an, an alliance friend that occurred, Dale. Keep it up, Neo! 
<laughs> there we go, that was fast. That was spectacular. All right, just one more. And just one more battle, I have to do it. Is yeah, that just... This really has to be very precise and give me the one thing that I need. Although that's a severe extra doubt on that. <laughs> There we go. We're unstoppable with you around. How's that? <laughs> I'm the Oh, is that that's a big ten. Back to being a healer with them. This time around we have come off back again and hopefully there'll be something new. Oh that has something new to say. Please, I'm begging you, let me go with you. Maybe I need to go to Connie Mega then? Maybe this is the point? Press the mark! I am so confused, it's, it's very darn specific with this. Perhaps we should pay a visit to the lab. There might still be something hidden there. Oh, now you will act. Mm. What is this place? And is that a cradle? I remember this room. Anything you want to tell us, Kamaravi? This is where I awoke. Met Miyabi and the others. So that means that cradle is... It is no simple cradle. Fitted inside is a device which matures a life to a state close to homecoming. That makes sense. So that's what Y used when reviving Mwamba and the others. Yeah. Kamaravi? Is that cradle still usable? The installation works, just barely. Why do you ask such a thing? Uh, Ethel, you're not thinking... Our enemies are supernatural beings. Monsters who use human lives for fodder. You can all fight against them, but me, as I am now, I'm barely able to protect myself. All I can really do is hang back and watch, so as not to be a hindrance. But, suppose I was to use this cradle... Ethel, you don't have anything to prove. As far as the choices available to you go, you could also return to the city and live a peaceful life. And yet, you're saying you want to throw your body back under war's grindstone and spend your life fighting. But then, you are ever thus. By the time you speak your mind, your body and soul are long ready. I think you should do as you wish. Kamaravi, are you sure it's fine? To embroil her in what's ultimately our fight? Ethel's path should be hers to choose. I'm certain her resolve is firm. If she wished for a life of peace, she would not have followed us this far. The way must have been inside her all along. I suppose that's true, yes. But still, I am anxious about the result, same as you. Nevertheless, as a devoted follower of none other but the warrior's way myself, I wish to respect the will and resolve of one who has chosen the same path. 
I believe Ethel's freedom is hers to do with as she wishes. Thank you, Kamaravi. At the same time, I am of course not in a position to decide such things myself. We have conveyed to you our desire. Would you tell us your opinion in turn? <sighs> well, what should we do? Just do it, I want to have a bag of my body. There's the FY love. How are you feeling, Ethel? Oh, never better. I mean that literally. It's as though new strength is welling up inside of me. This way I'll be able to fight by your side too. You have my thanks. Huh. What's wrong, Kamaravi? Silvercoat. Oh. Silvercoat? What does that mean? I'm not sure. When I saw you just now, the word simply came to me. As though something was guiding me. What in the world? This sensation. From where did it spring? Kamaravi. I can explain. What we should be thinking about now is the future. What we can achieve in unison. No? Huh. I said I could be your eyes. That has not changed. Just as you showed me the way before, let me now be your guide. You are right. You can see that which I cannot, indeed. I wanted to live life true to myself, but the answer is still not clear. But perhaps by working together with you. Let's search for the answer hand in hand, Kamaravi. With unity between us, nothing can be impossible. Oh. oh, so that's how they're doing. And of course, I just now get it at the end of the journey. But welcome back, Elf. Welcome back. I so need to get that leveled up. But it's possibly fine because where we're going might hope possibly question mark. <laughs> well yeah. That's every single hero we can acquire when it's just playthrough. I'm getting peckish. Do we have any snacks? Clean your body, clean your mind, I guess. <laughs> Cured being thirst. Right then. Should we get a move on? There's still always a potential for post game. Oh, why did I need a little for <laughs> I was about to say, where else did I go in there on your four again? Oh yeah, levels. See, that's really behind that. God dang, why? <laughs> I get... Okay, never mind. I get that was behind me so, by so much, but god dang. <laughs> then that's going to be that super, super tougher than me. <laughs> me and the crew at 69. <laughs> Night. But that the way we can now 
We can now continue on to main quest. Back to my office room. Well, greater, <laughs> greater room, I should say. Hi, I'm back. What? Why are you here again? <laughs> so you quite excitable. Peace of origin. What fate that they would be the ones to guide you. <laughs> oh, Nia. Ouroboros and the Sword of the End have. They brought us this far, so I wouldn't be surprised. I understand. Well, in that case, I will gladly concede it. Right? It was all a part of your grand design, yeah? Uh, the future must be sculpted with one's own hands. Something like that? Uh, no. Right, certainly. <laughs> God damn it, Nia, stop lying. Something you can just be given. You do have to reach for it with your own hands, yes. <laughs> Uh, I know she's trying to fill a wolf, <laughs> especially since she's not fit for warranty, but God. Well, that's the first. Five left to go. A promising start. Yeah, could be worse. Keep going like this, and job done. Thank you, Majesty. I promise you, we won't waste this gift. <laughs> now can we please stop it? How will you access Origin, even with the ship? I mean... We're gonna plunge into the Great Sea's Vortex. And after that? Origin is protected on every side by thick armor plating. Huh. You think you'll find a booth? I guess... Uh, maybe? Maybe? For starters, we don't even know Origin's general schematic. We're going in blind. Basically. <sighs> Take this. Huh? What? What's this? Is this... Origin? A certain Nopon engineer was involved. On the Agnian side of Origin's construction. Huh. That's an early blueprint left behind from those days. The Great Sea's Vortex is likely born from the force field emitted by the core, perhaps? amplified by the structure built up around the circumference. That would be my best guess, anyway. As for the original purpose of the structure, it was a device to deploy a field to protect the facility while it generated an omnistatic space. Consequently, this middle section here, it lacks the armored shell, making it Origin's only weak point. Mm. So then, Basically, this is our entrance. Yes. Enter the vortex, and then using its flow, break through to the inside. Once you are within, destroy the force field generator at the center. Uh-huh. That's the trick. Yes, I see. Understood. However, the internal structure of origin may well have been heavily modified by Zed. Could be, yeah. Even after you make it in, you must be on your guard. Understood. We'll be fully prepared. <laughs> I won't. Huh. You gotta hand it to the Queen, though. How could anyone know all that? Shocking, I know. Absolutely. I simply cannot believe this. Come on, you lot. Make your minds up already, will you? <laughs> Here all this time, right? 
Yes. So then, how did you know we'd become Uroboros? You seem to know what had happened at the castle as well. Even as I sleep, I learn. Information on everything in this world collects right here. Huh. I was wondering where the giant thing so was. For all this. I promise you, we will seize the future. But the power of Ooh, boys. Okay, bye for you this time, Nia. Love you. Aw, oh, so happy. <laughs> That's my girl. That's my waifu. That's the yeah. suspect of Origin Metal taking care of. Oh, I'll call for Mr. Salon. Hello? Friends find to spawn now? Yeah, just a moment ago. You've got good timing, man. What friends think? Someone plays call after seeing source of signal moving. Very evident to prove to obtain. Oh. Well, uh, you know what I say to that? Meh! His senses can check such a small displacement? Truly impressive. Mr. Simon, I'm guessing since he called us. Ah, yes. Have finished the case of data analysis. For only two places, however. In north of Atea region and east of Candesnia uh, region. God. <laughs> Words. The O2 signals, someone could tri uh, triangulate for more precision. Data to stop data, so please check. We got it. Take the game, Mr. Simon. Not to worry. Please to, ke to keep up good work. So, it here and Cadesnia next time. The one that here is. Huh. In Everblight Prime. All the way back to the beginning! And for Cadesnia, Dave seems to be pointing to Cape Acapole and the University of Sea. Right here, let's go on with the last. Back to World 4 to begin. How's this journey? Even after it finds the use. Outsource battle and the origin part which we need right over there. I mean, I would still matter. I just had to go for this. <laughs> I'd be very dumb. <laughs> it's like, oh, where the hell do I go? I don't know. Right for the empty body of the fallen for honest. <laughs> it's not like it's metal, it's covered by the. Freaking top of it, amazing anymore. It's just, it's hollow on the bottom. What, what was I expecting? <laughs> Good fact, this is way easier and way earlier than I need to. Oh, and surprisingly, there was a whole queue too. Might as well get this because we need to actually get this knock on stone here. Death Mushroom. Oh ho! Signal of Origin Metal coming clear. Must be getting, must be here now. Just starting to feel like Treasure Hunt. Vigo get kind of excited. You know, you got a point. It is kind of like one big world hop in Treasure Hunting Convention. Alright, come down and rest the signal then. It's coming from over that way. If jump by this is reading, probably behind that ridge. Hey, Manana, wait for it. Okay, but Manana, like if I'm easy. The origin metal signal was coming from around here, right? Bye. Huh. Interesting. I guess this is it? Together with the one we got from a match, the Dynamic 2. It's good luck that we found it so quickly. We can only hope the other pieces will come to us just as smoothly. Let's check down the meadow and contest near. Alright.
Oh, the case of Swords seem to be behind Waterfall. That's unexpected. See how it went on its going, at least. Alright, let's go. The origin metal signal was coming from around here. Alright. Where to start? Uh, we can start by ignoring that unique monster. <laughs> we can start by ignoring it. Can't it? That's the uh, third one, right? Half down, half to go. Meh? Oh, new data just arrived from someone. It looks like we're going to the Pentelas region and Fornus. This part of Pentelas. It smacks the Wildwood, I think. And as for Fornus, looks like Zion's town. Zane's town. I could words. <laughs> I could words, guys, I swear. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> but while all that points of interest there might be buried. I don't know. Just a hunch. Is this where the readout for the origin metal's coming from? We'll find it. I dare say we're becoming old hands at this. Hmm. Very strange. We can see reading of origin metal, but not anything that can fit Bill. The one that does seem to be pointing us here. That means the sound is done goofed. It doesn't seem very likely. Well, not too likely, at least. Is it, is it possible that it could be buried under the surface? Oh, you've got to be joking. Please tell me we're going to have to dig this whole place up. Dig the whole place up? Got it! Please cut it, course. I'm going to hate this. That's not taking his list. I'm not looking forward to that somehow. Nothing here for us to find. Hum hum hum. Not much sense to sense of tingling. And not anyway here. Griffin must be, say it must be further off. Not upon his senses? It's the fact that I'm located in, in this area. Well then, let's first my answer to it and try digging around here. A little further away, huh? Maybe over here? There wasn't anything buried here. Ba ba ba! I mean, I feel close. Close, nice. I'll be find it soon. And just take this to go to the left. Dawn. Being very close, have gut feeling. Just a limit to my trust, you know. Ugh, that's a forward down. Let's take somewhere else nearby. Huh? What's this then? Not a water metal, but that much is certain. Ah! <laughs> Maybe over here then. Search. Here. Oh, for fuck's sake! God fucking damn it! <laughs> I really was fall off. Better this read the next? Yep. Feathers where the origin metal was buried. There were also a few turkin feathers where the origin metal was buried. Hmm. So turkins buried it. Crafty little gigs. Yeah, definitely. Any hoodles. <laughs> no, not that reason, this reason. 